Um, new AirPods Max and $99 AirPods to launch as early as next year. Okay, well, $99 is more interesting than Max. I'm not a big fan of the Max. Mm. Uh, it's For me, it's too heavy as a over-the-ear headset. Now, I know what they're doing, the premium materials and so forth, and a premium price tag to match, but I start to get fatigued on the headband and such. Like, mm-hmm. this headphone that I'm wearing here was selected because of the ergonomics, the weight, the fit, and so forth. Sure, yeah. I mean, they sound good, too, and they have a super minimalist look to them, mm-hmm. but ultimately, like, and you can probably attest to it, you forget you're wearing these things. Yeah, they're very comfortable. So lightweight. Anyway, mass shipments of second-generation AirPods Max and more affordable AirPods. Uh, in a series of tweets today, Quo, this is Ming Chi stuff, said Apple's aiming at a $99 price for more affordable standard AirPods. Uh, those are $129 at the open. That's a that's a uh, at the moment. That is a major psychological barrier. The hundred dollar barrier mm-hmm. to go from uh, $129 to $99 convinces so many more people. They're like, it's hundred bucks. Yeah, it's hundred bucks. It's two it's digits. My money. Two digits. I'm not convinced. Three. I'll take some. So like everybody else at this point that hasn't acquired AirPods at the moment, mm-hmm. <clears throat> now they can get that at the $99. You mm-hmm. could see it. Also, there's another good reason for it, similar to the iPhone space where there's too much crossover price-wise. It's like, wait, the regular iPhone model is too close to the Pro model. Why would I bother getting the regular one? And then it's just there's not enough separation there sure. between these two things. And I just realized, by the way, if Kirk's going to sit there with his mechanical <laughs> keyboard, that's going to be an issue. Because <laughs> that is, what switches are those, man? They're brown, right? They're red, dude. They're oh, they're red. red. I knew he was going to say something. Wow, man. That's it. unbelievable. He's just firing off over there. Yeah. Mr. Email over there. Yeah, clicking and clacking over there. It's unbelievable <laughs> stuff. That is, we saw a real world reaction to Cherry uh, MX red switches right there. Why? Is it you or is it the chat? Oh, I don't know. I didn't actually even look at the chat. It's just, I, I mean, eventually it would come up. If I can hear it, yeah. they can hear it. So. Anyway, um, so 99 is a big threshold for people, mm-hmm. and uh, it creates more distance between this all these different models that, that that exist now, right? With the, well, how many do you have right now? You have the the Pro, you have the Max, you have this, one with the charge, the wireless charging, one case, with a wireless charge and one case, the, right, the regular original, and, and one original. And I think are they not selling the OG version as well? Of okay. AirPods without the more bulbous ear tip? Is that out of the question now? Why do I feel like I'm just, that thing is still out there in some sense or another? Am I crazy? I might be. Yeah, like the second generation, you're still able to find it. I don't know if Apple's selling it, but it's still out there. Okay. It's, that's what I'm trying to get at here. But it's it's a lot to choose from. 99, big barrier. Um, and then AirPods Max, make it lighter, please. And thank you. Yeah, I'll take it. And maybe not f- uh, 550, although you know it's going to be 550. At least.